So pretty exciting day uh, for two reasons. Reason number one, Sunday hockey starts up again tomorrow. So very excited. Reason number two, they called to say that my new kit is in, but I gotta go out to Pure later to pick it up. Hey, do you wanna see our driveway? Just kidding. We don't have a driveway. Let's go get the gear. You don't need a driveway when you got new cold gear. So basically the scoop is that our subdivision is so new that Pure Later thought that this wasn't even an address, so that's why I have to go pick it up. No biggie. Somebody might have got some new gear. I know, it's me. So let's uh, dig in, see what I got. I'm not getting surprised. Ooh, but I'm not surprised because I ordered it myself. Duh. Um, a new chesty. Uh, this is the Warrior RG5 Senior Plus, not the Pro, not the Senior, the Senior Plus. Boom. Uh, then what else is in the goodie bag? Let me reach in. Wow, this box is deep. Oh, got it. New pair of pants. Get out of here. Humongous box. Be gone. These are the CCM Axis 1.9 goalie pants. Why did I buy these things? I bought these things because, um, Pro Hockey Life had a flash sale <laughs> and they were 20% off. Uh, and so uh, I did a little bit of shopping. Let's dive in a little bit deeper. I'm gonna explain why, uh, why, why? I'm gonna explain it all. We'll start with the chesty and go through what I'm using now, why I actually was looking for a different chesty and uh, what I think of this one. This is my current chesty. It's a uh, Warrior RGT2 Senior. My chesty before that was a RGT uh, Intermediate Double XL. This is a Senior Small, and I just got it last year. And I liked it when I was on the ice, it felt great. I never ever felt like a puck or anything. Like I never had a single stinger. On my intermediate, I would get a stinger sometimes. Um, but the intermediate was just, you know, it was smaller and probably a little bit lighter and I could just move in it so well. This one on the ice, it felt really good moving in it. Um, but honestly, like if I had to adjust my helmet, I was like, ah, 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 ah. That, you know, I couldn't, I felt I couldn't get there with it. Um, I also felt, I don't know why, because I don't really think there's a big difference, and that's part of the reason I got the new pants. I felt like it wanted to ride up a lot, and I'm sure that's adjustment. I don't feel for a second that's the fault of um, the chesty, but I, I was kind of looking for a different one. I would really like to get a pass, maybe a, probably a Paso custom chest protector, but I just don't have, that's just not in the, in the piggy bank right now. Um, but I was looking at, and I, I'm a fan of Warrior products, I've, I've really liked them, so I, I wasn't, um, you know, I wasn't disgruntled, I wasn't looking to, to move away from them altogether. So I thought that these, um, I don't know what they, I don't even know what they're called, but like the shoulders on these were a lot bigger and square and I thought that they kind of, maybe that was what was limiting a uh, bit of the range of motion. So I looked at the G5, which seems, somehow seems a little bit lower profile for me. Still like humongous arms. Um, so I gave it a rip and I've adjusted this to sort of where this one was so that there'll be a really similar feel. So I've shortened the, the arms, um, Paul shortened the arms actually, but, and it's easy, you just, it's just like a lace thing, so I shorten them up to the shorter position, 
and it just feels like I can move better than it. So the, the test for me is always putting on my jersey. With this one, I felt like I was just always getting hung up and couldn't couldn't get my jersey on. But with this one, it feels it's not it's never easy, is it? But it feels a little bit smoother getting it on, and I can like I feel like when I have to like you know move my adjust my mask or take a drink of water, it's not like. Uh, so it could just be psychological um, it could be that it is a little bit lower profile but uh, so far I, I like it and I've left these extensions on there's extensions at the side there's extension and the belly pad so I've left all that stuff on and it feels great when I wear it with my new Axis 1.9 goalie pads from CCM. So why new goalie pants and why did I go with CCM? These are my previous goalie pants. They are warrior goalie pants. Uh, they are the Ritual X. They are an intermediate double XL again. And um, I like them. I have had a couple stingers in them, but it's maybe you guys are the same. It's like how, like, where you get the stinger it's like how did that even happen like there's padding there so it's it's not the pants fault again i think it's just just bad luck that it gets in there but i did feel like um you know if i reached or moved that my chesty would come out of the pants i feel like they have a fairly shallow um waist and so that my pant my chesty could get up on top and then that maybe was part two of what would make me feel like it was pushing it up and I wear suspenders and I tie down my chesty and I do all that other stuff so it really shouldn't be riding up so I thought hmm. so I was looking at the CCM pants and uh, they just looked like they had a lot deeper waist on them so that I could get my chesty tucked right in there and that it might not ride up and over quite so much. Um, I also like, you know, at first it was like, wow, these legs look really wide. Compared to the warrior leg, the CCM leg looks really wide. So I really wasn't sure, like, am I going to like that or is it just going to feel too bulky? Let's do this. Why don't I slide these on uh, and then look at how, how I kind of put them together. My suspenders are off at the moment because on Sunday at hockey, uh, I skated out on the ice and one of the other players was like, hey, you got straps hanging off you. I forgot to pull them up. <laughs> so we just unsnapped them, but actually it felt fine. My chest protector felt like it sat in a good position. I'll probably put them on again for Sunday, but I actually don't feel like I need them. So let me slide these on and show you how I hook them up. Welcome to the new goalie training lab, by the way. Uh, these are the first videos I'm shooting down here. Still not exactly perfect. Probably going to rip all the pink insulation off the walls. So we just have concrete walls and we still have loads of stuff to put away in the background, but we're getting there. All right, let's get these on. These pants have an internal belt that's sewn right in. The Warriors had an internal belt, but it was removable. So when I first saw that this internal belt was sewn in, I was like, ah, nah, nah, I'm not going to like that. But it actually feels fine, and it's probably why I don't really need the suspenders. So I just, I don't tighten it, that internal belt. I just snug it up so that my pants aren't going to fall down. Then I make sure that I have my old rib protectors kind of tucked right down in there. That feels good. Then I bring this up and it just has a single loop. I used to tie on this one, I'd tie it under my breezers, but this I feel fine with just the single loop. Like that. Tie her down. I wear, I always wear a neck protector. So I have a, a CCM um, that kind of fits like a little vest and it has an integrated neck protector. And I wear a dangler. So this sits fine. With my helmet on, I can look down. It's not, this one I always felt too, like my helmet wanted to hit it. This one, for whatever reason, it doesn't feel that way. Then with this belt, I just, I just take the slack out of it basically. So that, that is the setup and it feels, it feels great. So these do feel way more bulky. Like, you know, we're supposed to get dressed as much as we can before we get to the rink. I feel like I could put those pants on and drive the car. Uh oh, here's a test. I have an itch on my neck. I could sort of scratch it. <laughs> I feel like I could probably have worn those to the rink, uh, driven there in the car with those on. These, it's like, there's, there's no way I could drive the car 
with these pants on. I'm sure there is a way, but I don't feel like I could. A lot more padding in the sides and in the back. These ones, um, you know, they're like, they have a little bit on the sides, but really nothing in here. These ones actually have like padding that padding wraps around more in the back. But once I'm on the ice, you know, they move just fine. Like I don't, I don't notice them in any way. So I think that's a really good sign. Uh, what's the difference between the 1.9 and I think it's just called the Axis Pant. These do not have the D3O, um, which I think is a shock absorbing material that's like more high tech. Um, these just have like, I don't know what it is, but it's really, really firm. So uh, yeah, that's the new kit. And I know you're gonna ask if I've had them out yet or played in them yet. I have played in them two times so far and I really like them. I feel like this gives as good a protection as my GT2, but it lets me move better. And even if that's just taking a drink of water or adjusting my helmet, I don't know why, but before it would be like, oh God, this, I can't, you know, it puts that idea in my head that I can't move with it on. This one, I feel like I can move better. The pants are way bigger, uh, more protection in them, but I can move in them just, I don't even notice a difference from my old pants and I'm not fussing or again, I'm not worrying. Oh, I think my, I think my chesty sitting up on my pants a bit and kind of trying to tug it down. It feels good. Probably I'll venture into not wearing the suspenders because probably 40% of the time I do forget to pull them up. <laughs> so, so, uh, and I think with this combination, I can do that. So I really liked this kit. Um, there was just little things. I kind of like getting new gear anyway. So I'm looking, always looking for any little excuse, but I feel like this was all a step up that suits my game better and how I feel on the ice better. So what, now it's your turn. Take a second to drop a comment below. Let me know what is your current chest and arms? What do you like about it? What, what would you like it to be a little bit better? Let me know if you enjoy these gear reviews. Maybe just hit the like button. That'll be our secret code. Uh, if you like them, then I'll do more of them. I will see you next time. Don't forget to subscribe. I don't know if I'll fit. <laughs> For sure it won't fit. Man, I need to work on my mobility.